If you heard that the Gymshark February launches are gonna be lit, then you heard right, girl. Welcome to my bedroom. Yeah guys, I know, a little different mix up. I wanted to take advantage. Usually I cannot film in my bedroom in this new apartment because this road is freaking obnoxiously loud. But because we just had a huge massive snowstorm, no one's on the roads today. We got peace and quiet, baby. Okay. I am so pumped for today's video because Gymshark is releasing some dope launches this month. I know you guys have been seeing it all over social media and all that good stuff. Y'all be hitting up my DMs, girl. I'm here for you. I just wanna note that I have half of the haul right now. Yeah, I said half. We got a whole other haul coming soon. I'm waiting on the second half in the mail. Didn't wanna keep you guys waiting, all right? Cause I know y'all are fiending for it. So this is what I got going on today. Loads of vital and training and some et cetera. So you guys know the drill. Definitely subscribe if you're not already. Follow your girl on IG for all things fitness because together we got this baby. And once these babies go live, okay, I'm not allowed to announce the date yet, but keep tabs on my Instagram story, baby girl. I promise you the second, down to the second, that I'm able to announce it, you know I will. All of my measurements will be down below for you guys. And as soon as this does go live, I'll be linking every individual item so that you can have easy, fast access to it in case you see something you like. So everything you see today is in my true size. Small, I always order small in Gymshark and for the most part, it's always true to size. I will go into detail with each and every one of these collections to let you know if they're true to size or not, in my opinion. I'm gonna go ahead and start with the collection that I know all of y'all wanna be knowing about right now. And that is the new Vital Seamless. I know you saw that yellow. So um, yeah, right now we are working with the yellow and the warm taupe color. <gasps> they also have a really beautiful like twilight blue color. Oh yeah, check that one out too, girl, it's really pretty. But yeah, so this is what I got going on. Huge thank you to Gymshark for sponsoring today's video too, by the way. So I say new Vital for a few reasons, guys. This new vital is different than the older vital the one that you are used to there's a few differences with the new vital let's start with number one different type of material that's a huge deal okay because it definitely fits and feels differently with a different type of material whereas the old vital was nylon polyester and elastane this new vital is only nylon and elastane so you do not have the polyester in it straight up you can feel it's still very soft but it's definitely more in my opinion, I would say lightweight. It's got a little bit of that like kind of thinner type of vibe, just overall, just a lighter weight and a lighter compression. The old Vital had more of a high impact, tighter, just more form fitted type of compression, higher impact. This one has more of just a moderate type of impact, which is actually really great because I do love the look of a Vital, but I don't necessarily need that crazy, crazy high impact with what I do necessarily. And girl, I'm just saying that I personally feel like my glutes look better when it's in moderate compression. Nothing's really like tucking it away. It's now like, boom, in your face. You know what I'm saying? So if you want your glutes to be just popping, mm-hmm, yeah, I'm digging it. I'm digging these. So because it has such a high nylon base, it is extremely wicking. So that's what's up, girl. You can sweat up a storm and you're pretty good, especially with this yellow, dude, this yellow. I was concerned with this yellow. And when I did try it on, it was about 85% squat proof. So not 100% on me. Whereas this warm taupe, I didn't see anything coming through. So this seemed to be my 100% squat proof. But I'm still rocking these and I will continue rocking these because I mean, yellow, enough said. The overall look is very similar in terms of the contour, that dotted movement, that kind of thing. The under booty contour is still the same. You still have the racing contour down the crack, but a big difference is it's just an overall, like more almost like for me, I feel like more minimal of a marl design. In fact, I can barely see the marl in the yellow. It kind of looks just very, very solid of a color, like as if there's no marl in it. I also noticed the biggest difference that like I was, really happy with was the fact that I noticed there wasn't that like obnoxious gape that I know the old vital I 
sometimes had some trouble with. This one had that support that I like. The band was very much intact for me and it just felt like it was just nice and tight up against my back. So definitely appreciate that. New vital, huh? Okay. The sports bra is very similar to the old one. I just feel like there's a lot more support going on. You could feel it's more of like a nice, solid, moderate support. You still have the removable bra pads and all that good stuff, but I definitely feel when doing like jumping exercises, I feel like it's, it's like holding the girls a little bit better than the old one where it was like light as a feather. This one's got a little more intact in my opinion. So I'm obviously I'm wearing the sports bra. I also have the long sleeve crop. You know I love my Vital long sleeve crops, girl. They're my favorite when it comes to working out in a long sleeve crop. Vital Seamless is the way to go for me. So yeah guys, honestly, overall, my thoughts on the new Vital, dope. So bottom line, I love my old Vital and I love the new Vital, okay? I love them both. I think it just depends. It depends on the type of workout I wanna do for the day. If I need a high impact legging, I'm gonna go with the old Vital. If I need more of like, I'm just trying to show out my booty and lift some weight, girl, then probably the new Vital because that band, mm, that band helped me feel real nice and secure. You know I like that, girl. Okay, so next up, you know I like my training, right? So we got three full length training leggings in the newest, most special, just craziest designs I've ever seen. These patterns are legit. So these are not the 7 8 although they will be carrying new 7 8 colors. What I love is that they kind of broke boundaries with the training leggings, whereas they used to just be solids, just straight solids, nothing to it. Now, ooh, they spiced the game up a little bit. So if you're that kind of girl who just wants like some crazy type of leggings with like a solid piece up top, mm -hmm, they did it. The training leggings are known for being super affordable, especially for Gymshark. So the fact that they came out with some really fun designs, winner. I personally love them. They're super soft, like yoga based type of leggings. You would know if you saw my last review on them. They are definitely like underrated in my opinion. They're still high-waisted. They're just not seamless, but that is okay. They are yoga, they're athleisure. They're like the kind I just wanna like pop on and just enjoy my freaking day. Is that all right? So that is what I like to wear them, is the just a low key kind of day. So first up, we are looking at a light gray linear, linear. So first up, we are looking at a light gray linear swirl. If you wanna look like a dessert, this looks like sprinkles in my, when I first saw it in my opinion, I was just like, dude, you look like a sprinkly dessert in these leggings, okay. I really like how in certain parts, like up more towards the upper thigh area, near the crotch hole, they have extra sprinkles. So next up, we got a sage green camo. Oh, this looks like somebody painted a camo design. It's got that paintbrushy like look, almost like sponge work, if you will. You know that look, that sponge work. This is really cool. This is like, dang. You even have like geometric lines breaking it up. It looks like somebody actually took a leaf and did those leaf prints on you. You know what I'm saying? You dip a leaf in paint and then just that kind of look. <laughs> you have like three different shades of green in here. You got that really dark, like hunter green, and then it goes more to like a lighter and then a light, light sage. And then you mix it up with that white peeping through. Yes, okay. The third design we got is the dusty orange camo. Oh, so pretty much the same idea, but this is more of like a, hot heat, that kind of element, desert vibes. Do you live out west, girl? Do you live in the southwest? Do you wish you lived in the southwest? Because this kind of does that for me, gives me a little fire in my belly. And this one just gives me more like a, I'm in the forest, I'm a tree fairy, desert queen, tree fairy, desert queen. I like to spice things up a little bit. Not every day. Okay, some days I'm just boring ash where I just put on a black legging, put on a baggy hoodie, hood up, and just get the frig out of here. But other days I'm just like, hey. These are squat proof on me, and they are definitely still true to size. They're still the traditional training leggings if you're used to them. Same with the Vital, very true to size. I wouldn't size down and I wouldn't size up in them. They fit me perfectly, I feel. Your girl got booty shorts. <laughs> So you know how the training collection has different types of shorts? <laughs> well, I got sent some cheeky ones. These are the short shorts. They also have like the normal size shorts coming out too in different colors. 
but um, I guess I got this one. I'm gonna showcase. <laughs> it's a little, uh, <laughs> but you know what? I am getting a little bit like feisty in my old age, so I don't care. So these are in the color, oh God, what are they called again? <laughs> this is in the Havana Orange Linear Swirl color. So again, you got that similar where it looked like sprinkles on the other leggings. This don't look like sprinkles. This looks like war. So these, um, they have a cut where it comes higher on the sides of your legs. They're very sexy, just warning you. Um, if you don't really feel comfortable wearing them out and about like that, like me, I wouldn't necessarily wear them outside of my apartment <laughs> but what i would wear them for is under the loose fit training shorts or another gymshark pair of shorts that do not have that kind of security underneath if you know what i mean so this is a really good way to grab like a nice little secure pair of Spanx, right especially like i said the affordability of these grab a few solids too throw them under a loose fit and you're good to go so they also came out with dope patterns for the loose fit training shorts. Yes, I couldn't find a name for this, so I'm going to call it the monochromatic geometric loose fit training shorts. That's what I, okay. I love the loose fit training shorts, but like I said before, there's nothing underneath them. So you definitely need to wear Spanx unless you're just ballsy like that. You know, there's nothing wrong with that girl. Do it. <laughs> You still have the really nice, like, thick Gymshark stretchy band. Everything's the same, but the pattern, okay? They came out with new patterns and new solid colors we'll be releasing. They're beautiful. There's another one just like this in the same identical pattern, but a lot of oranges and reds. Oh, do I want that one. I really like this one because it's a neutral, so you could pretty much wear any color up top and it'll go. Again, we love a nice loose fit, feeling free as can be, and it still comes up higher on the sides, which I like. It's very, very flattering, really emphasizes that leg and makes you just kind of peekaboo. You still have the grip liner inside. I do feel like I don't need that grip liner because I don't feel like it really does much for me. Overall, I would totally say these are true to size, but could be sized down if you prefer a little more of a tighter, more just a smaller, less loose fit, you could size down. Me, I'm comfortable with my size small. That's just me. All right, lastly for the training, I actually snagged one of their cropped sweaters. Love their cropped sweaters. <sighs> so this is more or less something I like to wear to warm up at the gym because you will warm up in seconds type of thing. This is not something I want to sweat in by all means. This isn't wicking. <laughs> it will trap heat. This is also really great to just wear out and about, like with a high-waisted pair of shorts or jeans, because hello, this is hella cute. So we got this crushed lime color, perfect like neon lime green to just spice up your freaking spring wardrobes. I don't know about you, I'm done with winter. I'm done, I'm disgusted. So any type of brightness I could bring into my life right now, I need it. So when I saw this color, I just had to have it. I really love the training sweaters because their fit for me is just, it's like nice and loose and almost boxy, but still so freaking cute and like flattering, all right? The cut where it comes ever so slightly higher on the upper abs, you know, it's like a little, mm, little rainbow design and gango, little down in the back. The cuts are really where it's at with this sweater for me. They have a really nice stretchy ribbed underarm gusset that goes down the sleeve and all the way around like one big rainbow down the side. So it is still very flexible. It's not a tight fit. You can move around, stretch around, do whatever you gotta do for the day. And it's really just an ultra cozy, inexpensive way to just top off your wardrobe, top off your set for the day. Beautiful. I want one in every color. The lime's where it's at though. So uh, lastly, Gymshark came out with something called a uh, color burst. <sighs> Woo! When I saw these, I almost died, girl. I almost had a freaking heart attack. I got heat red acid and fresh teal acid. These color designs be making me feel like I'm on acid. <laughs> they trippy like that. I'm here for it though. I never said it wasn't. Uh, so yeah, dude, like straight up. I feel like this is like the summer thing. I'm gonna be wearing all summer long. When I go on, hopefully, if I go to the beach sometime this 
decade, then I would absolutely be wearing these. These loose fit, mind you, these are loose fit, oversized. This is something I would say you absolutely could size down in. Me personally, yeah, I'd size down on them. <laughs> if I could do it all over again, I would. When worn just regular, these shorts, they are, they look like I'm wearing kind of like a men's, small men's kind of shorts, beach shorts, things like that. So I would size down, but in the meantime, I've been rolling them. And if you roll them enough, like twice actually, if you roll them twice, then you'll get to the solid underneath this color. And I feel like it looks really flattering having the solid band mixed with the more graphic below, totally optional. You do have a draw cord inside. So if you wanted to cinch it in a little bit, definitely, and tie it up, it'll help your shorts kind of look a little more flattering, a little more form-fitted. But like I said, depends on how you like to wear your shorts. You do have a back pocket, one back pocket, no front pockets. Keep that in mind. They are very, very freaking loose. Wear something underneath if you plan to put your feet up, girl, on a car ride or something like that. You might be causing some accidents up in here, girl. You don't wanna do that now, <laughs> do you? So yeah, the matching hoodie, like I said, again, is super oversized, very, very comfortable, something totally to lounge in. You got the hollow letter text straight across, which is really nice. I love that pop of white against these colors. And these shorts have like the more solid text, no hollow lettering. So it doesn't actually like match with the top, but that's no biggie. It still looks really minimal. It looks like water to me. Like, I feel like this is a mix between like a tie-dye look, but more of a new age tie-dye, like modern tie-dye. This also gives me underwater vibes. Like I'm looking at the light going through a pool, making it look all funky. You know that feeling? You know that look of a pool water? You do have that front hoodie pocket that can, that goes all the way straight through. Yeah, dude. Overall, the texture of these, they're very much like cotton base. This isn't like your active wear, where it's like a, a wicking machine, like polyester and things like that. This is more or less like something that feels like you would wear on a beach, you know, when you're you're wet and you want to kind of keep warm. It feels a little bit like insulated. Like there's really no like that much breathability here at all. It's almost got that rugged feeling underneath that you would wear when you're a little sandy. So you don't ruin your nice active wear. This is what you wear over top. You feel rugged. And I mean, I just got to close out with talking about how freaking beautiful this like red and orange is. Ah. Uh, it's just perfect for a nice hot day. You just radiate heat. I'm wearing the shorts right now, rolled up like I like, <laughs> and it really does match the vital so well. It is not the same shade, don't get it twisted. But from far away, it works. It really, really works. So as soon as I saw this come in and I saw the vital, I was like, I gotta do this. This is, this is a match for me. So yeah, definitely cool type of design. Something I'm gonna be wearing a lot in the summertime for my beach trips, keep me nice and cozy in those car rides. Yeah. All right guys, so that was the full part one haul of the Gymshark February releases. Don't get it twisted, girl. There will be a second haul coming soon, as soon as I get my other package in. So just be patient with me, baby. We are hoping to be getting the ombre, the animal, some more training pieces, <sighs> lots to come, so stay tuned. I wanted to wait till I got everything in one bunch, but I literally couldn't just sit here and not film when I had new pieces in front of me, especially you guys, your messages. I know, I know. I'm here for you, baby. I'm trying. Yeah, I'm really trying here. <laughs> so if you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Do not forget to subscribe if you are not already and definitely follow your girl on IG. Pay attention to those stories because I will be absolutely updating them every single day. And when I can talk about these new release dates, I will, I will, I will. Let me know if you have any questions in the comments below and I will try my best to answer them as correctly as I possibly can. Thank you all so much for watching and I will catch you in my next video.